We have 44-year-old Jose from Texas. He has been suffering for years. He's been in a ton of accidents, jumped in a lake, hit his head on the bottom. He's rolled an ATV onto his body and been in a traffic accident. He's had low back pain and sciatica forever now. He has balance problems, vertigo problems. He has anxiety, brain fog, constipation, and this terrible foot drop. He's been to physical therapy trying to fix his foot drop. He tried to juice. He took a lot of medication. MRI, recommended epidurals, three of them. Recommended surgery when that didn't work. Went to 30 different chiropractors in his lifetime. Not one of them ever adjusted his neck and only two took x-rays. Travesty. Here we're checking his uh, range of motion. You can see his back pain right here. Here's his drop foot. He can't lift the outside of his foot. Terrible. You can see he's struggling trying to squat here. He has a reversed low back. That's part of the reason why his herniated disc blew out. Watch me treat him. Ooh, that was a good one. I'm Jose and uh, I'm 40, 44 years old and I deliver out of hip pain and lower back pain and it goes down to my uh, right foot. So how long have you had this back pain, leg pain? About eight years. I fell off of an ATV. I fell off on, on my on my side and I tried to help uh, the ATV and tried to redirect it and that's when uh, my whole body uh, collapsed, like exactly. low, low back pain gotcha. and my uh, and your right, right elbow, right? Right elbow. I've been uh, seeing chiropractors. Uh, they we wanted to do surgery on me, and uh, I have uh, I've been stretching a lot, eating. Uh, I mean, drinking minerals and painkillers and muscle relaxers. How many chiropractors have been to? Uh, my closer close to thirty. When do they recommend surgery for your back? Three months ago. How many epidurals have you had in your back? Three. Why haven't you done the surgery? I'm afraid I'm not going to be able to work and have a yeah. so normal life. Don't do surgery, guys. It's pretty stiff. Um, I get uh, nauseous. Um, I get a lot of vertigos and I lose my balance. My right I feel my right clavicle higher than the other one. Blurry vision, left eye. Four or five years of anxiety. Gotcha. And the depression, we talked about it being what? Uh, How often? Two, three times a, a month. Constipation? Mm, a lot. All your life, right? Yeah, I had a CAT scan and they, uh, once again, they recommended surgery. Yeah. Okay. And he has a hernia disc is where? L4, L5, and S1. And S1. And he has foot drop too. How long have you had the foot drop? About a year. Foot drop is when you can't lift your foot up. He's, he can't lift his toes up. Best you can. How much pain in your back there, sir? About a six. About a six. Go ahead and stand up. And where's the pain? Is the pain going on your leg or just in the back? It goes down my back of my legs and my lower back. Well, that got you. That back like this, sir? How much pain there? About a six or seven. Lift your toes up and down like this. Okay, can you guys see how bad that is? That you can hardly lift his side. Now switch legs, try the other leg. Hold on. That's normal, guys. And then back to the other one one more time. So you can't lift it. And you can't lift it right here. It won't go up, okay? That's a neurological problem from his back. Any pain in your neck there? No. How about that? Uh, about a three or four. Plus. How much pain in your knees or back? Uh, Stand up. No pain on my knees, but a four on my about back. About a four on the back. guys ready to see him get adjusted? I am. X-rays are really pretty bad. Lots and lots of arthritis. He has a growth in his muscle in the back of his neck also. Tells me a long, long, long standing overexertion of his neck in that bad, posi bad position. Again, lots of arthritis. Tons of arthritis in his low back. Uh, military low back. Uh, actually reverses down there. Um, that's probably why he has these herniated discs because his back is just in terrible shape down there. We have 10 millimeter right imbalance and right TMJ, pretty good one. Over the top low back arthritis here, really bad. One third atlas wear, enlarged EOP, bone growing in the muscle and arthritis of the neck. Here we have a reverse lumbar curve, really bad one, and arthritis in the low back. So most important thing, Jose, is just to relax the best you can, okay? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna go right through here. He has one tight puppy. Ooh. That actually went a little better than I thought it was going to go. A little surprising. A little surprising? Feels good. Left side's usually a little easier. Patience and why is it easier on the left side, guys? Because uh, people are right-handed versus left-handed. Your dominant side will be the side you push the most and create the most muscle spasm. Ooh, that was a good one. That was really good. And <laughs> you heard that one? Yeah, 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 yeah. The right side was tough, but the left side went. Kaminga.
Upsy daisy, Jose. Careful, he's a little off balance. Now we're telling him not to twist or turn or he will undo my work. Let's check in to see his first impressions. I feel lightheaded. Lightheaded, gotcha. Uh, I think I see clear. Clear, right? Yes. Like everything's HD, right? Yes. Yeah. Very bright. And you said you already had blurry vision in the left eye, I think, before? Yes. And it feels different already? It does. Now for a little recalibration. Let's reset the whole body by walking down the hall. It really works, guys. Does this feel any different? This walk? It does. Very different. What is very different about it, sir? Uh, my my lower back doesn't hurt as much. Uh-huh. Uh, my right leg is not numb anymore. Yeah. And I can actually move my right foot a lot better now, or much better. It feels a little different? It feels different. Right Still on. weak, but I can move it move it uh, easier now. What did I treat on you, sir? My neck. Your neck. Did I touch your back? Not at all. Did I massage your foot? No. Did I do anything to your leg? No. Just your neck? Yes, sir. So on a basic scale, and how long ago was that? That was like two minutes ago? Just about. How much better do you feel? I'm kind of curious. On uh, a percentage scale, I'm just kind of curious. I would say at least uh, 35 to 40% better. And that was two minutes ago? Yes. I'm trying to educate you guys on this. The neck is the most important part. How excited are you right now? I'm very excited. I'm very gotcha. thankful. Good. And I'm very thankful to have you here. Thanks for doing the video. That was a six a minute ago. Look at you, baby. You look like a porn star now, all <laughs> bent over. I would say it went down to like uh, two or three, maybe? Two or three, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's no pain. That was a seven a minute ago. Yeah. Yeah, see? Look at this guy get emotional. Been a long time, huh? Oh, yeah. Yeah. What does this mean to you to feel like you have some hope right now? I mean, it means a lot. Yeah. It does. You know, people don't realize how much pain destroys your life. And uh, when it gets as bad as this, when you're having depression set in a couple times a month, you know you're going down the wrong road. Yes, sir. He's a strong man, but the brain can't take it when the brain can't take it. Yeah. Good. Okay, uh, one more thing. Squat for me, please. Come on up. There's no pain. <laughs> Say goodbye, Jose. Goodbye. So we're going to do his first adjustment in the chair. We just taught him eight patches today, so I always like to do this adjustment to uh, loosen up the neck-shoulder connection. How much pain is this, sir? A lot. A lot, right? Good. In your nose, out your mouth. I feel very light. Very light and uh, without pain. Without pain, right? Yes. Gotcha. Now, uh, this is the feeling you want to feel when you're chasing the A-pans. Okay. Now we're going to adjust you in the chair here. Just the lower part of your neck. Your neck and your shoulders here on your back. Okay, let this go. Okay, let this go here. Drop, drop. What do you think? You okay? Yes. That went really good, guys. This one's going to go easy. I can feel that setting up. A lot uh, less pain on my hips. My calf muscles and yeah. my back. Eight years. Eight years, percentage-wise, how much better? Uh, between 80 to 85 percent. Gotcha. Well, it was very interesting. I learned a lot. Um, I got to learn a lot of the things that I was uh, uh, doing, the bad habits that I was that I had on my poster. Mm -hmm. And uh, you taught me a lot and as far as how to walk and how to prevent uh, getting in pain. Doing my walks around the building, uh, my my hips would get super uh, tense and they would um, hurt a lot. Gotcha. But uh, I would do the exercise you taught me and I would, would reduce work. the pain. What's the difficultness of the exercises? Staying focused and uh, recovering my balance. Pain down your right leg. It's gone. How it's, much better is that? I would say it's about between 20 to 25% uh, stronger. Strong. Uh, right neck pain. Uh, there's no more pain. There. <laughs> Carpal tunnel, you had some stuff in your fingers? Yeah, it's gone. Uh, constipation, dry poopy. I uh, got a lot better. How much better is your sleep, dude? I slept like a baby last like night. Like a baby? No anxiety. And the feeling of depression is completely gone, no, right? Gone. Dizzy for the every day for the last four months? Not anymore. Left eye blurry? Uh, it's uh, clear and uh, I feel focused and very alert. Brain fog, less blood, brain fog, right? Yes. What is the only adjustment I've done on you all week? 
my neck. He wants to do the clavicle and, my, and, my and his back. And so what I say, yeah. I said, no, no. I'm so lucky to have my wife. Oh yeah, right. <laughs> say, it right say, it. say it right now. Say it right now. I'm so lucky to have my wife. There's some video. It's on video. Yeah. So I know it. <laughs> right there. So as inflammation goes down, guys, um, it's less painful for the adjustment and I get a better adjustment. A little tender on this side. Right there, I can feel it. Okay. Sweet. That was good, right? Yes. Okay, go ahead and lift your foot up and down. Good, 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 good. Hey, by the way, do it without holding me. You couldn't even do that at all. You guys look back. He had to hold the door last time when he did this. Yes. You were falling all over the place. <laughs>